Hi everyone. You guys seem to get me in the car a lot, which is okay. I guess it's my time to, uh, to really, um, have a moment to talk and to do a video because being a mommy and full time and then wife and sleep, it doesn't leave much time for, I guess, some videos. But anyways, I am starting a new segment on my channel called VSG Life Hacks. Um, and maybe these are things that are already around and my brain came up with them on its own, but, or maybe something that I read online from a random, random VSG or as well. Um, but I thought I would start, just a little bit. I thought I would start off with, um, something really useful being on my pre -op diet um, the three days before my surgery so my surgery is Wednesday tomorrow Sunday I have to do clear liquids from Sunday to Wednesday so my family and I are, we're planning are planning on going out tomorrow and spending the day out um, doing we're, we're, we're going Pokemon hunting I'm not even gonna lie we are going out to a little city and we're gonna buy tickets for the little train trolley that they have and there's so many stops because it's a historic city and uh, we ride the train around because it goes really slow um, and you can get off and on and everything like that. Well anyways, we're going Pokemon hunting all day and I'm gonna have to find some place that sells clear liquids like soup or something like that. I guess I could bring my own, but I would prefer if I can go to a restaurant and buy some soup. And then, um, and this is where life hack number one is going to come into play. The other day I was contemplating, you know, how am I going to integrate my VSG life into my normal life and not feel like I am excluded and unable to live alongside of my family when we go out to eat and such like that. So, and to make sure I get adequate protein, I'm really concerned with nutrition in the sense that I don't want to have a lack of protein because um, when after I had my son, I had a lot of hair loss and it's grown back, but my hairline was just had bald patches in it and I'm finally getting it back and I have hair under here that is just like this baby hair and I really don't want to lose it again so my um my biggest concern with diet and everything has been making sure I get my protein in so the other day I ordered a formula container off of Amazon and I tried to find one that didn't look so like I'm a formula container and I hold baby formula and I didn't use formula I, bre I was a breastfeeding mom no prop no no nothing wrong with formula fed fed is best but I breastfed so I didn't already have one of these um, and there's no more oh looks like I might have somewhere to park at my work um, so fed is best of course let me just say that so I didn't have one of these formula containers so I got this one off Amazon this is the Juvie Juvie brand and um, I filled it up with my unflavored protein I'm using iso pure um, unflavored protein and I put a serving in each one scoop in each segment so as and I just keep it in my purse I have serving in for my lunch today cuz I bought tomato a can of tomato soup with me so I'm gonna put um, uh, a scoop in to my soup after I'm done cooking it at work in the microwave and I well, right now it has tea in it. it has some um, decaf Harney and Sons peppermint tea, which I love. Love Harney and Sons. But after I'm done with my tea, 
I will um, rinse this out, put my tomato soup in it, and then and then, I, and now while then while I'm working doing hair, I will sit my lunch, which actually was really convenient yesterday. I was slammed. I worked my booty off from nine to six doing hair, and I had a second while a client was conditioning to run into the back and throw my soup in a container or microwave it and put it in my cup and I came back and I sipped it while I was finishing my client's hair. So today isn't going to be much different than that. Um, just a shorter day. Saturday's always a little bit shorter um, at our salon. Um, but I still think I'm not going to have much room for walking away and eating. Um, I'm doing four colors and four hours so it'll be a nice fun day but anyway I hope this helps someone because I feel like this is gonna really help me make sure that I keep up with my protein um, what I hear the the success to weight loss with the VSG is keeping up with your protein and if you don't keep up with your protein your body's hold on holds on to all the stores and you won't lose weight as fast as you would you know without with good protein and water intake as well so I'm trying to be the most I'm a very prepared OCD person I'm like nesting for weight loss surgery it's kind of crazy um, I'm getting my bag together for <laughs> my my hospital stay and I'll be doing a video on that too on everything that I'm packing um, to keep myself entertained while I am in the hospital because my husband won't be staying the night with me because we have our little baby and I don't want to, we haven't really left the baby with a sitter. <laughs> We're not there yet. Um, so he'll be, he'll be leaving me at night so I'll need things to do and read and stuff. But anyways, I'm going to let you guys go. i got a few minutes before my first appointment gets here so I'm going to go in the salon, drink my tea, get a get a water from next door and stop my day. I hope everyone has a wonderful sun or Saturday and I will see you next time. Bye.